Men of War Vietnam stands out because we show both sides of the conflict, unlike most other games about this war. The first campaign tells the story of two Soviet military consulates who were sent to Vietnam to teach marksmen and demolition skills to both Viet Cong and their fellow North Vietnamese soldiers. We purposely show the involvement of the Soviet specialists because not too many people know about their support of the North Vietnamese people. The second campaign is about a U.S. Special Forces squad. This squad fulfills a variety of tasks behind the enemy lines. Some of these tasks include reconnaissance, setting up ambushes, diversions, and supporting the Allied offensive, as well as many others. In the first stage of development, we improved the graphical part of the game engine. We implemented HDR that helped us to achieve a more realistic and vivid picture. We also enriched the object shadows on locations and improved water, so that now it reflects glare from the sun. All objects and environments, including plants, buildings, Vietnamese huts, and even household items were created from photographs. This allowed us to be as authentic as possible to the atmosphere of the time. Before creating game characters, we studied many photographs of soldiers from both sides who participated in the Vietnam conflict. This led to around 30 characters. Each one plays a role in the war, from the usual machine gunners and riflemen to pilots and tank crews. My favorite in the game are the Special Forces. They have some very special abilities with weapons. I was invited to be an expert on the game. The game was very interesting, and I was captured by it immediately. The graphics are beautiful. Really, all of it is. Explosions, weapons, everything is realistic. What can I say? Usually in Speznats, all men are equal, but they have specialties. For instance, there is a sniper, combat engineer, etc. It's like this in the game as well. All of it is very realistic. The developers did very good work here. We were thorough when we worked doing the research on the military equipment and weaponry for the game. We studied all the available data and photographs that we could find. And the final results visually look extremely realistic. The game features 17 vehicles that were used during the Vietnam War and about 40 different weapons. We added a new unit type never seen before in a Men of War game. Helicopters. Of course, we kept the main features of the series. You can control any unit directly. Another interesting feature is playing the campaign cooperatively. 